Welcome back to NC Bassin. Today we're back on Lake Norman. Today I'm on Nick's boat. He's won two back-to-back -back tournaments. Hopefully he can show me where the, the good spots are and how to catch them today. It's supposed to be a good cloudy day. They should be biting. It's like 60 degrees, feels good. A little bit of wind today. Shad should be roaming with the shad, with the, the clouds out. Herring should, or blueback herring should be out too. We should be catching them. Hopefully we can get some topwater action. I haven't been able to get much on topwater lately. Let's see how it goes. Got him. I guess I'm a square bill. <laughs> He's not a keeper though. Trailer when you need it. There we go. Good God, he was going crazy. Fish, I'm gonna at least have this. I'm not even gonna weigh him actually. I know I'm gonna catch three bigger than that. Oh, that was nice. They're right here, dude. Right here in the boat. We can cast back that one. Yep, that'll count. Best three wins it. Oh, oh God. Already. They're back here, boys. Did he come on? No, he's still on there. He's little as hell. Well, that didn't take long. <laughs> Is that a hybrid? Yep. Well, we found the hybrids. See, that's the size that the guy was catching too, mostly. Little guys. He hit it like a hybrid too. Slammed it. Crazy fish. About that one. Yeah, probably. Can't weigh him in, right? Yep. Thought he was big, but he ain't. Well, he hits it like a giant. And he's a baby. Yeah. Fish. Oh, a little baby. Always on the corners. Actually, ain't that bad compared to what we've been catching. Big fish of the day so far. Oh, dang it. <laughs> a little, little tiny crankbait. It's bouncing off the rocks. Oh, I gotta get one over 14 now. I got my two under 14. There we go, just had to hit the pole. Big old giant. God. As I smacked that pole, we hit it. Probably scraped my line the hell. Big giant Lake Norman fish. Ooh. Large mouth. Little baby, white as snow. Well, we got a we got a ball game now, folks. That's right. It's close now. I'm still winning though by a little bit. A little guys. Surprised you caught one that small on it. There we go. Throw on the worm. Monkey see, monkey do. He ain't big enough to matter, though. I already got my 214. I got to get one over. Little guy. Caught me while he's catching them all. Got him for you. Hey, what are you, little? <laughs> large mouth, though, baby. Got all these baby large mouth out. It's probably a good sign. In a couple of years, we'll have some big largemouth in this lake. So far, we got 214. We've not caught a single keeper yet. We're having a little three fish 
limit tournament against each other and it's been a struggle we're catching a little fish that's about it he had one good one that's probably about 15 inch little spot he went to flip it it come off so hopefully we can catch a big fish it's coming down to the end so one person catch a keeper it'd probably win the tournament so it goes fish on and another little one. Oh, might be 14 it's possible could be big fish in the tournament a little largey and he's not he's little Mike Cole we're struggling to catch one over 14 that's for sure I think both of these are bigger actually like I did. Oh, this thing will help. RG. He's over 14 too. Flip him. Oh, a giant! A giant! He's 14. I don't know the still store up. We've seriously caught more largemouth today than. It's like they just show up in the fall and the spring and then they disappear again. Yep. And then half the stale's gone. Looky there. That's the kicker fish. It's time going. Well, it was a tough day today, guys. I mean, we barely caught them. We caught some little ones this morning, but only one fish over 14 inches. I had two of the bigger ones. I mean, we caught some tiny fish, a lot of little largemouth, which is probably a good sign for the lake in the long run. Hopefully we get, with all the grass down in Huntersville, with all the hydrilla growing, I think the largemouth population is about to go back up on this lake, and that could be a good thing. But we didn't catch anything with size. We caught one over 14. I had to lead for, like, the whole day, and in the last 30 minutes, he catches a decent little largemouth. It still wasn't very big. It was like a 15-inch, probably pound-and-a-half largemouth. It was a tough day. We didn't catch anything with any size. He did lose a, a decent little spot. He was flipping in and come off right when he was flipping in. We couldn't. It was a terrible day. We didn't figure him out. I don't know what I'm going to do Tuesday. I'll have to figure it out. Hopefully, I'll get on a good pattern by then. Hopefully, maybe when it gets a little bit colder. I think with it being in the 70s the last two days, I think it's got the fish turned back off. And It was a tough day. Little fish are out. It, we just couldn't figure them out. Hopefully, I'll figure them out Tuesday. We'll see you on that video.